you are welcome or welcome back again to another video my name is bright ac so this is really midnight i woke up very late in the night to start preparing this ride for my sister-in-law's matric because we'll be traveling to a faraway place so i need to get this done before it is morning i am going to be cooking a paint of rice for this party and I'm going to be carrying you along. Please like my video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't. Let's do this cooking together. So these are the ingredients I got from the market that I'm going to be using to prepare this party jollof rice. I have the jima which is mixed spices. I have nivina. I have tiger curry and even thyme. I've already removed a few of it the sauce the ground oil and also my maggi this is the fresh tomatoes that i already grounded with a garlic and shombe and this is the sachet tomato that i'm going to be adding to it and if there is need for more i'll still add it i've already washed the chicken and uh, right now i'm going to be seasoning it with salt and with more salt and onions i'll also be adding maggi to it and then i prefer using more chicken let me mention that for anything rice okay rice or stew and then thyme Okay, I'll also add Jima mixed spices and then it's ready for me to like turn it and leave it a bit for some minutes so that it will the seasoning will get into it so that it will have a great taste at the end. Then it is ready for me to cook it. This is few minutes after I started cooking the chicken. Like I mentioned earlier, after sourcing it, I left it for some time before I started cooking it and I didn't add water immediately. I allowed it to bring out its own water and this is the time for me to add my own water to it. If you do yours like this, it is going to help it to have a great taste, okay? This is one of the reasons I started very late in the night to do this preparation. This is the carrot and the green beans and it's already sliced ready to be used. I am just done the boiling the rice which is the first stage of making a jollof rice or making any rice in particular. I just added cold water to it and then I am going to be sieving it into a bigger sieve so that it will drain some water before I finally use it to cook. I prefer to fry my chicken first so that I will be able to use the same oil to fry the tomato. Okay, this is what I do when I cook jello fries, especially.
so this is me beginning to cook this rice proper the first thing i'll do is to add the onion into my oil i'll fry it a bit for some time before i'll begin to add anything and the first thing i'm going to be adding is my tomatoes not the fresh one but this So after frying the sachet tomatoes for some time, I'll just add the fresh tomatoes to it because I didn't want that sachet tomato to have that sour taste. So I had to fry it very well first before adding my fresh tomato. This is seasoning time. I just added tiger curry and I'll also be adding the Mivina to it. This is not just the quantity, but while I put it, I taste it to know if it needs more. I just added thyme to it and then the jima or gima, whatever it is called, mixed spices and also my no cubes and then i'll stir it i don't do it with my chicken water or any meat water when i'm cooking jollof rice because it gives it a great taste okay so i just added the chicken water which i showed you earlier and i'll just add more water that will be enough for me to cook the rice I just noticed that there is need for me to add more seasoning to it so I decided to add just Nivina and the mixed spices I also ended up adding more salt to it so that the taste will be great too Remember I did show you when I was frying the chicken, so this is it, this is where I kept it, okay? Finally, it is morning and things will be a lot easier for me now. This is where I kept my rice. What happened here is that before the start of this, I already felt this pot will not be able to cook that rice. So I had to reduce the water and then flow with it. However, it happens if it's able to cook it. If it's not able, then I can use the smaller pots to cook the remaining one when we are back because we don't have much time anymore.
and let me show you the takeaway plates that i bought from the market the takeaway plates are already washed the spoons and even the savage rubber ring and the nylon that i'm going to use to tie it i also wash this cooler in case there's need the rice is not fully done here if you are not familiar with what i am doing i'm using this nylon to cover it all because i don't have foil so it will help to cook it very well to help it to be well cooked okay it's time for me to remove it and i didn't want my rice to get burnt i'll just add the remaining other things turn it and off the light or off the fire in order for it not to get burnt okay this is me adding the remaining onions to it and also the carrots and green beans which we are already sliced after doing this i have to turn it very very well before i bring it down finally So I decided to use this small flask to bring out some portion of food and keep aside in case there is need for that. Show. And the world will know. 
we are finally at the end of this video please support this channel by liking this video and subscribing to my channel please remember to come back next time for my next video bye